There's one rifle that we haven't used in over two years. And now that we have the red dot sight, we're going to be using it. And talk about one heck of an ultimate way to test this thing out than going for a 270 yard shot. We're going to be taking the red dot sight and going for a 270 yard shot on this giant mythical Cape Buffalo. All right, guys, here we go. Woo! Man, that looked like a pretty amazing hit to me. Definitely drilled him. <laughs> All right, guys, you got to admit, that was pretty epic. We pulled off a 270-yard shot on that nice Cape Buffalo there with the red dot sight and the 338 that we used for the first time ever in over two years. I mean, that Cape Buffalo didn't go 25 yards and piled up right here. Look at where he went down. We took the shot, what, right down over there? And he ran right to here. And honestly, if we wanted a really cool picture, we could definitely get one as well. Because look at the scenery. Look at the background from this view right here. That's a pretty cool spot for him to go down. But anyways, we're going to pick him up and see how we did. We pulled off a 267-yard left lung shot with a 338 right through the shoulder blade and got a 140 gold gray mythical. Cape Buffalo down. So pretty decent penetration considering we hit the shoulder blade and still busted through and got lung at over 260 yards. So I know you guys know that we have the 338 with the red dot, but we also have something for these guys out here. And we happen to have, if I can find it, there we go. We got the AR 308 on us with the Argus scope. And I would love to try and take down quite a few of these out here. I was about to take another shot. Oh, man. Oh, what's happening? Holy stampede. Oh, my God. Oh, where'd they come from? We got more coming. Oh, that's a big one. That's a big one. Keep an eye out. Keep an eye out. There's a giant Gemsbach running through here. We got the 338 with the red dot. There it is. There it is. Dude, we hit it. We hit it. On the run with the red dot. I don't know how good we hit it, but, uh, well, there it goes. No way. <laughs> we smoked it. It's going down. Oh, my God. That's a down potential Gemsbach. That was absolutely massive. And that's what I was looking for. There we go. A giant mythical line. He's about 300 yards out there, guys. I don't know if we can take this shot quite or not. We're going to try, though. We're definitely going to try. Come on. Get on him. Get on him. Oh. Ah. Okay, yeah, we might be able to. I'm going to zero in for 300. Oh! Oh, I shot too quick. Got a little too excited, guys. I don't think he spooked. Oh, my God. We're so lucky. Whew. There he is. 370 yards out. I thought we would have smoked him. We definitely did not get him. I don't think either way we're gonna go over there in a second and go get him but for now we got more stuff coming this way holy look at this another Gemsbach two more Gemsbach coming right towards us just smoke that one reload reload oh my god that thing just piled up And another solid hit there. Drilled that one as well. We got another one coming across as well. Yeah, it is far. That's why we hit him that time. I wasn't holding high. That time I held high and we drilled him. All right. So we literally have animals piled up absolutely everywhere here, guys. Look at the hunting pressure. We got Wildeby stacked up here. We got Gemsbach stacked up. We got a giant level four down there. That's actually dime potential. We're going to go check that out in a second. But um, for now, let's just pick some of these up and then get back over and try and get that giant mythical line. But like I said in yesterday's video, make sure you always follow rule number one, and that is making sure that your rifle is reloaded. There we go. 140 yard trotting shot and got a spinal cord left lung shot and got a gold on that 301 male gold Gemsbach. But that's not the big one. The big one is a giant female 
that ran over here and i'm pretty sure this should be her let's have a look she was massive i could tell from a long ways away that she was a giant and here she is right here it's gonna be a 323 gold and we pulled off a running 160 yard perfect left lung shot absolute money right there and smoked her wow and she's a light gray as well so she's not far off from a diamond only about like 12 points off so for a gems buck that's a pretty big one but there we go walking 320 yard double lung shot and a nice dark gray that's a cool looking one almost looks kind of melanistic but it's not all right let's get over here now and find this giant mythical lion and along the way we're gonna find a couple more wool to be stacked up over here i was just saying that we're probably not going to be picking them up I was just saying that we're probably not going to be picking most of them up, but then we ran right into them. So in that case, we're definitely going to pick them up for sure. Look at that. Got another wildebeest down over there, but then we also have some Gemspock right there. I might be able to take this shot. Oh, I'm definitely taking that shot. Smoked him. And he rolled right over. What a nice shot. All right, can we get another one on the run as well? Oh, I couldn't tell you where we hit on that shot there, but... We were a little bit far back. Potentially one more. Nope, didn't get him. That's all right. We absolutely drilled this one. Plus there's a wildebeest over here as well. So let's go over here, pick them up. And then our lion shouldn't be very far away. He really shouldn't be. All right, here's our wildebeest piled up here. Actually, that is not a wildebeest. That's another Gemsbach. But this is a wildebeest. Wait, was that a bonus? It must have been a bonus. There we go. That would have been a gold. Level four. Hit him at 300 yards. A little bit far back. Got an intestine shot. But this is the Gemsbach that we just took right now. Pulled off a 130 yard neck shot and a 310 gold female. I know there's a big male lion over here somewhere. Now it's just a matter of trying to find him. That is a lioness and another lioness right there. So clearly he's not there um that is not our lion either but it's definitely a really nice one a big old level seven out there so if we don't find the big mythical then we're definitely going to go after him either way in fact we're going to go after him depending on which one we find first hmm if we hold it right below the head that should hit something solid all right here we go 190 yards whoa that absolutely drilled <laughs> wow <laughs> uh we hit something good i don't know what we hit but we definitely hit something good because he's already down and that lioness doesn't even know what the heck just happened to the big leo to the big male she's just sitting over there chilling like uh frank where'd you go <laughs> oh my god you know i was actually worried that we'd have to go all the way over there to pick up our lion but clearly he's gonna float all the way back over here to us so we're not even gonna have to go over there and get him <laughs> look at all the lionesses here one two three lionesses lionesses that's that's so funny lionesses why is that so funny i don't know it just sounds funny well, I'll tell you one thing. We got one big male coming in right here, right to us. Let's have a look at this big male. 45.3 gold, and we pulled off a freaking double lung heart shot at 190 yards. Double lung and heart. Wow. That is some pretty incredible penetration, especially for this 338, which used to be one of the worst rifles, one of the worst like big game rifles in the game. A lot of times you would hit stuff. I can't even tell you how many times I've hit elk. Big bulls. 150 yards out. And I hold it right on the chest as it's facing me, right? And I go over there and get a flesh hit. But now, we're getting double lung and heart at 190 yards. But a 45.3 gold male line. Alright, so I am pretty sure that big mythical has got to be over here. If he's not here, then he's going to be over at that other water hole. So we're gonna work our way to the top of this ridge here and look down and hopefully we see him on the other end of this valley. Well, I suppose we could take down this six out here at about 200 yards. He's in the water as well. Centered him, 
hit him a tad bit back. But definitely centered him solid. Oh no, he is going down right there. Woo! Another awesome shot. He's not quite far enough in the water to where he's going to float over here. So we're going to have to go over there and go pick him up. Nonetheless, that's another nice lion down with the red dot and the 338. All righty, here's our lion down right here. Let's have a look at him and find out how we did. Ended up getting a liver, left lung, and stomach shot at 200 yards. I told you guys I hit him a touch bit back, but honestly, I'll take it. To get lung, liver, and stomach, that's a pretty good shot. All right, so there's pretty much only two places that this big male lion could really be. One is over here by Kunaval land, this water hole right here. Or the other one would be here, over by Vuxa, this water hole right here. There's really no other place it could have gone because we saw it right here trotting this way. I guess potentially it could have made it to here. So we'll have to check these three water holes here and hopefully we find them. That is definitely not him. 100%. Only one five medium male lion here. That's it. That's the only thing that's here. And I messed up the shot. But I didn't that time. Really? Absolutely smoked in that shot. All right, let's pick up this line and shoulder blade, shoulder blade. Both shots were almost identical. And then double lung took him down. At a level six jackal out there at about 340. I'm going to bust out the AR 308 and try. Got him. He's hit. He's definitely hit. Whoa, we had a bunch of wildebeest here, guys. Oh, man, I should have been ready on them. Woo! Woo! Well, we missed uh, once, maybe. Definitely smoked that big gold one, though. And that's kind of all I really wanted to get. Let's go over there and go get them. Uh, maybe we smoked a couple because that's level two hunting pressure here and that's level one there. That means we just hit all three of them. Maybe. I don't know. I didn't think we hit that good, but uh, apparently we might have. All right. So they ran right through here and holy, how good did we do? We literally have two of them on top of each other. Like, are you kidding me? How in the heck did we do that? Did we pull off a heart shot or like a double lung heart shot or I don't know. What did we do? How is this possible? <laughs> like we shot right there and they're laying both right here. I, I don't even know like what to say. That's pretty incredible though. Other than the fact that we must have pulled off a pretty magnificent shot. Or I should say, shots. Let's pick them up and find out what happened here. Alright, there we go. We hit that thing three times. First shot was quartering away and almost pulled off an awesome shot. But we actually did. We got liver on that shot. Okay. Then liver double lung on the run. And then we hit it again. In the neck. But that was only a female. But this was a running double lung heart shot and a 35.2 gold gold wildebeest holy i knew that shot was good but i didn't know it was that good what an incredible shot placement on this awesome gold wildebeest wow Woo. i mean absolutely just money shot right there the legend actually exists we just found this giant mythical lion which we've been looking for for so long now i thought we finally got him and then we went over there and it turned out to be a wildebeest but now we definitely found the one we're approaching the 200 yard mark here on this giant mythical lion now our goal is going to be to get under 150. if we can get to 150 i'm going to be honest it's going to be an absolute dream shot because we have no cover now, we're completely prone, and we really can't get too much closer. We're sitting right here at about 190 right there. He's quartering almost perfectly away from us. Like, I would love to take that angle, but I want to get just a tad bit closer 
because I want to be able to use this red dot, you know, as effectively as we possibly can. And that means getting less than 150 yards so we can really see the uh, full extent of the red dot. And just like that, we popped out here at 150 yards. There he is right there. Ooh. Okay, good. He stopped. I was going to say, hopefully he stops. It's still a touch bit foggy out, but we could go for the shot. Smoked him. Absolute perfect shot. Held it right on his front shoulder, and he's going down right there. Yep, he's down. Let's go get him, guys. Let's go get him. Boy, this lion really tested out our patience. I mean, absolutely to the max. But we finally did get him. Got under 150 yards out. And we made an awesome shot. Here he is. Let's pick him up. It's going to be a 46.9 goal. Pull off a double lung shot at 143 yards. And that shot was absolutely perfect. So it worked out awesome. And he weighed 534 pounds. But yeah, overall, you can see the red dot works super incredible on the lion and even the big game. As you saw in the beginning, we took down that big K buffalo at 260 yards. But that's going to be it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.